Students are returning to school after floodwaters forced them into a different building. It's news out of Crawford County tonight. Jackie Roberts visited the school today. She joins us now in the control room with that story. Jackie. Jill, a rainstorm in July left the bottom floor of a Crawford County school unusable for the first several months of the academic year. But now students are welcomed back to a refurbished and improved facility. Charge. For many students in classrooms like this one at Calvary Baptist Christian Academy, it feels like the first day of school. It's um, really nice to um, see it and have everybody back together. After spending months split between two buildings, the students are now under one roof for the first time this school year. Early July, uh, when we had the record rainfall, uh, the, the basement flooded. Um, and we had six to four inches of water, depending where you were standing, in the basement. Uh, destroyed the floor, destroyed a lot of furniture in the basement. The damage forcing students from four grades to take class elsewhere. Now the students are welcomed back to their old home with a new hallway and outlook. It's a lot brighter down here than it was. It used to have um, white halls and a white floor, but now it's a lot more colorful. The school development director tells us thanks to a generous donor, they were able to replace place much of the damaged furniture. They said, uh, why don't we buy all new? And they offered $5,000 as a matching gift uh, towards the purchase of new tables and chairs. But even with that gift, there's still more work to be done. The school is now accepting donations through the end of the month. The Meadville Alliance Church provided the space for those students to go to class while work was underway at the school. And the development director tells us he has nothing but thanks for the church and the people in the community who helped move this project along. Jill. It looks like a beautiful new facility. Uh, Jackie, thank you.